The following episode is part of a weekly series on the Screen Crush YouTube channel. If you like the video, subscribe to Screen Crush for more. You think you know this is Spinal Tap? Well, here's 11 things you may not have known about the band that redefined rock and roll. We are Spinal Tap from the UK! You must be the USA! Spinal Tap first appeared on the 1979 ABC sketch comedy pilot called The TV Show Starring Rob Reiner. Spinal Tap is portrayed by Michael McKean as David St. Hubbins, Christopher Guest as Nigel Tufnell, and Harry Shearer as Derek Smalls. The actors are all actual musicians and play on the soundtrack to the film. They also portray the fictitious American folk music trio, The Folksmen, who can be seen in another mockumentary, A Mighty Wind. Well, there's a puppy in the parlor and a skillet on the stove and a smelly old blanket and a Navajo wolf. McKean, Guest, and Shearer performed as both Spinal Tap and The Folksmen at a special one-night-only world tour concert at London's Wembley Arena on June 30th, 2009. Rock and roll! Rock and roll! Rock and roll. Yeah. Let's get it! Let's get it! Hey. No, no, this way. This way. This way. Rock and roll! Rock and roll! Rock and roll. Oh. There we go! Hello, Cleveland! Hello, Cleveland! Director Rob Reiner portrays a fictional director named Marty DeBerge, which is an amalgamation of the names of directors Martin Scorsese, Brian De Palma, Steven Spielberg, and Federico Fellini. Reiner and the three main actors are credited as writers, but much of the film is improvised, resulting in over 100 hours worth of footage. It's famous for its sustain. I mean, you can yeah. just hold it. Well, I mean, so you'd have to pull. Ah, you can go, go and have a bite. No. Nah. You still yeah. be hearing that one. Yeah. Cherie Curry from the band The Runaways had a role in the film, but her scenes were cut. In the film, her band The Dose was Spinal Tap's opening act, and she gave herpes to all the members of the band, which is why they have sores in some of the scenes. Many musicians have said that they don't find the film funny because it hits too close to home. So I watched it before a show, and it just screwed up my whole life. <laughs> Spinal Tap may be rock royalty, but Christopher Guest, the actor who plays Nigel Tufnell, is actually of British nobility. He's the fifth Baron Hayden Guest. He's also married to Jamie Lee Curtis, making them Lord and Lady Hayden Guest. How much more black could this be? And the answer is none. None is that good? more black. Is that Metallica's Black Album was an homage to Spinal Tap Smell the Glove. Where did the idea come from to do an all black album, Metallica representatives? <laughs> In 2002, the film was deemed culturally, historically, or aesthetically significant by the Library of Congress and was selected for preservation in the United States National Film Registry. The review you had on Shark Sandwich, which was merely a two-word review, just said, shit sandwich. Um, <laughs> Where'd they print that? that? Where'd they print that? That's not real, is it? Is it? You can't print that. And here's a bonus one. One louder. Why don't you just make 10 louder and make 10 be the top number and make that a little louder? These go to 11. This is the only movie on IMDb that is rated out of 11 stars. That's it for this episode of You Think You Know Movies. Make sure to subscribe, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and get the latest movie and TV news on ScreenCrush.com.